Welcome back. I've had two beers. Actually, I drank one. The other one got poured back into the bottle. Uh, Angry Orchard's Sinful Apple. Disgusting. Taste still sucks. Uh, the Shiner Farmhouse Ale 966. Mm. It's a seasonal beer, as usual. No percentage. Here's a bottle. Smells like god awful. Like a lot of nasty ass spices. Mr. Honey Brown didn't help out that uh that sinful apple. There are a lot of light beers today. I believe I've had a farmhouse ale before. I don't remember exactly what I thought about it. I got my legs spread apart like my ding-dongs 14 inches long. Ladies. Because I'm, uh, huddling over this nasty-ass sinful apple shit I spilled all over the ground. It's another Jesse Sex Life. Trickle, 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 trickle. So his mind would be painting the walls, boy. Look like a party. Now that it's out of the bottle, it smells a little better. My cat's outside. Very pissed off. See, what they mean by farmhouse is they, they find these old-ass farmhouses and tear them down, chop up the pieces of wood in little bits, and season the beer with it. 145-year-old wood chips in a beer. It's wet, but it's dry. Really weird. It's like if KY made a lube of sawdust. I don't know what kind of spices those are, but I don't. I do not like them. And I want to drink this because my day's been shit. And I want to get a little bit of alcohol in me, you know. Uh, since I can't go to the liquor store, I got a, a cherry chocolate bock in there, which I'm saving for a special occasion uh, by Sam Adams. And uh, I got some banana beer. I think I got like two left, maybe one. And then. Uh, Like five of the Ruby Red Birds of Shiner. Those are fucking gross. And then uh, I think she's got my wife's got some Angry Orchard ginger in there, which is pretty disgusting too. So overall, it's looking pretty bad. But I got some Jaeger spice in there. We haven't even cracked open yet. I might bust into that. Ooh, it's a little better. Still not that good though. Be back. Now let's step on this shit. There we go. Now I'm not in your face. There we go. You now I need to go back and look at my my other beer review I did. It was a farmhouse ale, and uh, I'll put right here what it was and what I gave it because I don't remember what it was, but I don't think I liked it. I don't think I like this either. But I still got a little bit more to drink. So, I wouldn't buy this again. Um, let's just rank it as an ale. Four. I've had worse. I've had ales that have been worse. Don't, I mean, don't get me wrong. Probably the first uh, three months of my videos, I'm, I'm just, I was saying constantly, ales suck, ales suck. Uh, 
Uh, it's kind of an acquired taste for an ale. A lager is a little more forgiving. Whew, excuse me. But with these ales, I mean, you gotta you gotta have a, a, a taste for them. this here and I'm gonna dump this out. I'm sorry I can't finish it. Um, I said a four. I wouldn't get it again. It's got a, a you know that's farmhouse. It's like they took the the farmhouse, tore it down, took the wood, chopped it up, soaked it in, in beer and squeezed all the beer out. Then they bottled it. So there you go. Mr. Honey Brown. He didn't get to fix this beer. Uh, but I'm going to go inside. I'm going to crack open another banana beer. You have a good one.